The Upper Hand Brewery is releasing a series of limited edition Sisu Stout variations that reflect back onto the Finnish heritage here in the Upper Peninsula. The first release happened yesterday, and it's got a breakfast feel to it. This release and is still on tap today. Um, it was inspired by Panukaku. Uh, anybody who's got a Finnish grandmother in the area probably would recognize it. Panukaku is sort of a risen Dutch pancake type thing. Uh, so we uh, we put in some of those pancake type flavors with uh, you know, UP source maple syrup, vanilla beans, um, to kind of give it that uh, that breakfast pastry sort of character, and it came across really nice. The Upper Hand Brewery is working on multiple variations of their current Sisu Stout, and it will be coming out every three weeks. Every three weeks thereafter, we'll release a new variation uh, inspired by another uh, you know, part of Finnish cuisine. Uh, we're going to make it in super small quantities, uh, usually just a keg at a time, so that's about 15 gallons. Uh, it may last for two to three days, maybe, maybe not even that, uh, and then it'll be gone forever until the next one comes around. Now as brewing goes, beer might have very few ingredients or many, depending on the taste that you go for. The Upper Hand Brewery is working with some familiar ingredients, but are diving into some new exotic ones. So some of it's new to us, some of it is classic uh, Imperial Stout barrel aged beer character. Chocolate, cocoa nibs are very popular. Um, things like maple syrup we have dabbled around with here. So there's a bit familiar and there's a bit that's unfamiliar. Um, ultimately, this big giant stout type beer, um, they they do very well on their own in a barrel. Uh, they hold up to that, that age, just like a good whiskey does. Um, but they also tend to serve really well as a template for other flavors. Now to keep the rest of the UP winter interesting, the brewery is handing out a punch card so people can keep track and look forward to the next release. So we have punch cards to kind of track whether you've come in and tried it. You don't even need to buy it. You can just come in and say, hey, I'd love to try a sample of the, uh, the Laka uh, Sisu Stout. And we'll be happy, happy to pour you one uh, for free. Now, if anyone gets their card completely filled, they will be receiving a special gift at the end of the last beer release. If you do all of them, then you can commemorate it at the end. We're going to hand out um, these uh, Sisu Stout uh, emblazoned stout glasses, which are nice little stemless wine glasses. Reporting in Escanaba for ABC 10 and the CW5, I'm Dan Callahan.